Hello everyone. We will show you in this video, how to install the agent on macOS 13. Start your browser. Open the website. Sign into your account. Enter your username. Enter your password. Click the sign in button. To add an agent from your dashboard, select Agents. In the menu on the left, select All. To create a new agent, click on the plus sign. If you do not want to put the agent in a group, simply leave the group field blank. Otherwise, to add the agent to a group, Select the previously created group from the drop-down menu. In case you cannot find the appropriate group, you can create a new one by selecting groups in the dashboard. Select the group. Enter a name for the agent. Optionally, you can enter a description for the agent. Click the Confirm button. Here is the newly created agent. You still need to install it on your device. Here is the installation code. This code, generated by the system, must be entered when installing the agent. Now, let's see how to install the agent. Start your browser. Open the website. Our system recognizes the operating system you are using. To download the agent, click on the download button. After reading the important information carefully, click on the download button. The file will be downloaded to your device. Click on Downloads. Open the downloaded file location. Right-click to open the context menu, and select Open. Right-click to open the context menu, and select Open. A warning window appears. Click the Cancel button. Right-click to open the context menu, and select Open. A warning window appears. Click the Open button. The installer is loading. Once the installer has started, you can choose to install or run the agent. Select the Install option. Click Next. Enter the password for your macOS account. Click OK. If necessary, here you can change the path where the agent will be installed. If the path is correct, click Next. Select Yes. Click Next. Select the Enter the Installation Code option. Click Next. Enter here the installation code that was generated by the system when you created your agent. Click Next. Installation has been completed. Click Close. After the agent has been successfully installed, one more setup is required for macOS for remote access to work properly. Open System Settings. 
Click on Privacy and Security. From the menu on the right, select Accessibility. To add a new item, click the plus sign. Enter the password for your macOS account. Click on the Modify Settings button. Select your Mac device. Select the storage. Select the library folder. Select the DW Agent folder. Select the native folder. Select the file. Click the open button. The file has been added successfully. Click on the back button. From the list, select screen recording. To add a new item, click the plus sign. Select the file. Click the open button. The file has been added successfully. Let's see the other device. Click on the refresh button. In the menu on the left, select all. To test the connection to the agent, click on the agent. The connection with the agent has been successfully established. Launch the screen app. The screen app is now running. Open the monitor. As you can see, the agent is online and ready to use. Keep on using it with satisfaction. Thank you for watching. And see you in the next video.